Welcome back. Now, it is the uh, video sharing app that has got millions hooked around the world and unleashed a wave of Generation Z creativity, all tightly woven into 15 second clips. Enjoy it, though, while you can, because US leaders do suspect there is perhaps more to TikTok than meets the eye, and a ban is now on the cards. Saskia Taylor has been taking a look. Oh, I like that one. Oh, that's funny. Oh, nice effect. Favourite. What? Starting tonight, TikTok will be banned in the US. No, they can't be. They wouldn't do that to us. We're greatly concerned that the Chinese Communist Party could use its control over TikTok to distort or manipulate these conversations, to sow discord among Americans and to achieve its preferred political outcomes. I can't believe it. All these years, I thought that the only thing dangerous about TikTok was that it wasted my time and my youth. But no, now it turns out that Beijing has been using me for political gain. That letter from the group of Republican senators to the Director of National Intelligence, the FBI and the Homeland Security Department said so. So it must be true. It's not like US politicians have previously evidence free blamed a country for meddling in its democratic processes and it all turned out to be a witch hunt. And you know what? Looking back now, there were so many signs. There were all those videos of people talking politics. You shall be known as Darth Vader. Then of course we got the Trump guy. And then next door we got the Biden guy. Hey Google, who will win the election in 2020? That's easy. Most people think Crazy Joe, but the winner of the presidential election in 2020 will be Donald Trump only if the coronavirus doesn't kill everyone first. No, what's up? I voted for a man named Donald J. Trump. Cause when the play in the end, I'm stand up. And it gets worse. TikTok's not just interfering in elections, it's also spying on us. Would you recommend that people download that app on their phones uh, tonight, tomorrow, anytime uh, currently? Only if you want your private information in the hands of the Chinese Communist Party. The Communist Party saw my double chin when I opened up the front camera. How embarrassing. But also, how nefarious. Here I thought TikTok was just for bored teenagers doing synchronized dancing. American companies would never do something like that. Right, Facebook? Thank God we are getting rid of that Chinese virus app, TikTok. You know, Facebook does the same thing, right? No way. Oh, he's so silly. Doesn't he understand that, oops, I did it again, Facebook uses our private data for good and nasty old Chinese TikTok for bad, just like Mark said. Facebook is a public good. You should be more concerned about TikTok. They're owned by China. TikTok collects personal info without consent, has been used to spread fake news, and is a national security threat. You know what? We don't even need TikTok anyway. Facebook came up with a clone, sorry, version called Lasso all by itself. Sure, they had to take it down because it was so bad, but teething problems. The second version will be much better. But I still can't get over how out of the blue this all is. Why would China do this to people who have only ever wanted democracy and peace in the world? Sure, there's that trade war and closing an embassy or two, and okay, fine, maybe they shouldn't have called COVID the China virus, and yeah, they did try and tell them what to do with their own territory, and sure, they've been grinding down Huawei while forcing everyone around the globe to do the same. But it's not like they're targeted or anything. China drove them to it with all that naughty behavior. It just never listens. And now it's making up some lame excuse for why TikTok's not wanted on US shores. Let's focus our energies on fair and open competition in service of our consumers, rather than maligning attacks by our competitor, namely Facebook, disguised as patriotism and designed to put an end to our very presence in the US. I mean, that's just ridiculous. I mean, the US loves healthy competition. That's why it's forced everyone to say no way to Huawei so it could get in there first with 5G, fairly. I think we need to take a moment to remember the real victims in all of this. So you guys, we have a dilemma, okay? I'm hearing that TikTok might be banned in America and this is the problem. I just started becoming famous and I only have 100 followers. Yo, John, don't you have like 15 million followers on TikTok? Yeah. Well, not anymore. They're banning TikTok. Dude, you're gonna have to get a regular job. Well, the clock's ticking. No time to waste. So, TikTok. Yeah, TikTok. It's a hit. Yeah, it is. But, uh, we didn't come up with it. Uh, no, you didn't. Yeah, that's gonna be a problem. 
Why? You, you love free markets. Of course we do. If we benefit. What, what are you saying then? A ban is on the table. Unless... I'm listening. No, I don't know. You helped us out in November. Mm. TikTok, TikTok. I don't have all day. I've got pandemics to fight and a civil unrest to quash. Mm. Oh, you're just too slow. You're banned. Probably. By the way, um, what's your algorithm? Uh, Facebook's asking.